அனைவருக்கும் வணக்கம் வெல்கம் டு சதீஷ் சைன்ஸ் டீச்சர் யூடியூப் சேனல் இஃப் யூ ஆர் டியூனிங் ஃபஸ்ட் டைம் இன் திஸ் யூடியூப் சேனல் ப்ளீஸ் டூ சப்ஸ்கிரைப் அண்ட் டூ ஷேர் அண்ட் டோன்ட் ஃபார் குட் டு ப்ரெஸ் த பெல் ஐக்கான் விச் இஸ் நக்ஸ்ட் டு சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பட்டன் தென் ஓன்லி யூ வில் கெட் ஆல் த நோட்டிஃபிகேஷன்ஸ் ஆஸ் சோன் இஸ் ரிலீஸ்ட் அண்ட் டுடே வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு சி தி புக் பேக் இவால்வேஷன்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் சோஷியல் சயின்ஸ் கிளாஸ் டென் அண்டர் த சோஷியல் சயின்ஸ் ஜியோகிராஃபி யூனிட் செவன் ஹியூமன் ஜியோகிராஃபி ஆஃப் தமிழ்நாடு so don't skip the video anywhere because if you do it you will get lost some of the main points and all the best for a competitive examiners okay let's see the book work evaluations from this lesson so what is human geography human geography is the branch of geography dealing with how human activity affects our influences by the nature and tropical crops like paddy millets pulses oil seeds plantain crops and tea coffee cashews rubber etc are the major crops of tamil nadu so tamil nadu has 55.3 percentage of lignite and 75 percent of vermiculture and 69 percent of dunite 59 percent of garnets 52 percent of molybdenum and 30 percent of titanium so that also main point and uh, let's see the book back evaluations choose the best answer the delta which is known as granary of south india is kaveri delta so kaveri delta is the granary of south india not only for tamil nadu okay so south india so you should carefully watch the question the delta which is known as granary of south india that is kaveri delta second one the second staple food of the people of tamil nadu is millets the first staple food of the tamil nadu people is rice the second one is millets because using the millets they are preparing cool kambanjor like that okay a major hydroelectric power project of tamil nadu is made to hydroelectric power project the number of major and minor power ports of tamil nadu are 3 and 15 so there are 3 major ports and 15 minor ports in tamil nadu and fill in the blanks agriculture of tamil nadu constituency 21% of its economy so agriculture of tamil nadu constitutes 21% of its economy satnu dam is constructed across the river tenpennai chennai international airport is the third largest airport in the india after mumbai and delhi so from this point you will get Mumbai is the first largest airport in India and Delhi gets second position the third one is Chennai International Airport so they may be asked which is the first largest airport in the India is Mumbai the difference between the value of exports and imports are called balance trade so match the following bauxite bauxite is abundantly found in Seravaraian hills gypsum gypsum we get gypsum in Tiruchirappalli region iron is in Salem limestone sir from coimbatore assertion is that coimbatore tirupur and erod region is called as the textile valley of tamil nadu because they contribute a major share in the to the state's economy through the textiles so both assertion and reason is correct and reason correctly explains the assertion and second one the nilgiri is the largest populated sorry least populated district of tamil nadu least means very very low So the Nilgiri is the least populated district of Tamil Nadu. Reason it is located in the western most part of Tamil Nadu. But the reason is correct, but it's you know, it correctly does not correctly explains the assertion. So option B both A and R are true, but R does not explain C is the correct answer. So that's all about the book work evaluations from this lesson. So go through it again and again till you will get more marks in the TNPSC examinations. so you should remember and uh, nh44 is the longest national highway in tamil nadu so you should uh, point out all those this also nh44 is the longest national highway of tamil nadu which runs from hosur to kanyakumari that is 627.2 km via dharmapuri selam karur vaigai madurai tirunelveli and state highways sorry national highway 785 is the shortest national highway in tamil nadu which runs from madurai to tuvarankurchi 30 km only madurai to tuvarankurchi so that is the least and shortest 
national highway that is nh785 and nh44 is the longest national highway in tamil nadu which runs between hosur and kanyakumari that also very very important in this lesson and um, and uh, the list of it parks in tamil nadu tidal park asentas mahindra world city for it and ites scz tidal i tidal 2 it and ites scz tidal 3 coimbatore scz and tidal park so scz stands for special economic zone so you should remember okay and tamil nadu dairy development corporation limited was transformed into the newly registered tamil nadu cooperative milk producers federation limited popularly known as obin and tanti tanti tamil nadu tea plantation and corporation limited is one of the biggest black tea producers in india with high quality clonal tea its plantation spreads over nearly 4500 hectares so tanti oda idu unda avu kada sir paathukonga so i think this is the time for signing of me satish science teacher